at our institute our major target on this bio incubation perspectives is to facilitate and mentor the generation and translation of these innovative ideas into the biotech product and services and this biotech product and service can highly promote the academia industry collaboration which we have been nurturing at our institute in national and international linkages also is being developed and uh, we together at this institute want to promote different area of life science uh, research which have been we, our uh, skilled uh, scientists and uh, others have been working for years together that really helps to encourage techno entrepreneurship enable creation and sustainability of uh, visible bio enterprises which uh, has been promoted uh, through department of biotechnology government of india and also the department of science and technology government of odisha for development of several startup program and i am very happy to say that those startups are doing extremely well and to with a strong initiation and guidance from our in, uh, institutes with a mentorship for generation of the translational component and for the betterment of the healthcare of the society at large Odisha University of Agriculture and Technology is the lone state funded farm university of Odisha and it is the second oldest in the country. It is dedicated for development of agriculture and allied sciences and also for the betterment of farming community of the state. We have the state of art instrumentation facility which is centralized in the university and catering to the requirement of the students and the teachers not only confined to oot but also from other research and academic institutions we hope that this facility dedicated for the science and technology particularly focusing on agriculture and allied sector will go a long way in developing agriculture in the state we are in the process of establishing one agricultural biotechnology incubation facility which will facilitate the students for de uh, developing their own projects and uh, also transforming them into entrepreneurs also you will be more happy to know that this central instrumentation facility has most advanced equipments like chromatography so also the electron microscopy facility apart from this there are many such facilities which are very unique in the bhubaneswar ICMR RMRC Bhubaneswar is one of the 26 institutes established under the umbrella of Indian Council of Medical Research or popularly known as ICMR which is the apex medical and biomedical research organization of the country the center's basic purpose is to support the health system of the of the state and the region through cutting edge research capacity building and hand holding and at the same time undertaking various researches as and when required looking at the disease burden prevailing in the region rmrc bhubaneswar is equipped with very high end sophisticated laboratories such as our regional virus research diagnostic laboratory which was which has played a very pivotal role in different infectious disease outbreaks and management most importantly very recently we have got a very high end equipment called cobas 6800 which is has got uh, very high uh, throughput uh, and at the same time its uh, diagnostic capacity is very accurate it's the research institutes which also offer ideas for the industry to con to come up with a product in this uh, making odisha conclave we are first of all we express our sincere gratitude for involving us and all through we have been very uh, thankful uh, for getting all the generous support from the state
Utkal, the oldest and the premier university of the state of Odisha, having NAC A plus accreditation and 88th NIRF rank, has been giving utmost importance to promote biotechnology, education, and research in the state. Government of Odisha, Rashtriya Uchyatar Shikha Abhijan, World Bank OHEPE, and our own support, we have established the state of art infrastructure to nurture the young talents pursuing MSc Biotechnology. The curriculum is being updated regularly and emphasis is being laid on hand-on training to generate a skilled human resources in a global competence. So six months mandatory dissertation program of MSc students renders tangible outcome and good publications. The laboratory facilities developed in the Department of Biotechnology with the lab facilities of Central Instrumentation Center facility gives the students a very good exposure to latest tools and the techniques of biotechnology which synergizes the energy to comprehend research ideas and innovations. I strongly believe that our continuous and sustainable efforts will definitely contribute to the growth of biotechnology sector in Odisha and will immensely contribute to bioeconomy. So this is a kit technology business incubator, which is a center of excellence in incubation. And since last 14 years, we have been operational in nature in Odisha in Bhubaneswar at Kit University. So uh, here already 210 odd startup company has been promoted uh, in the biotech sectors. And we have been supported by the Bayrag DBT Government of India and also by the SND Department of Government of Odisha. You will be happy to note that uh, the several companies have really gone to the next level to scale. And they have started the very simple ideas and they have built now bigger teams. In last 14 years, we have promoted more than 210 startup companies in biotech and they have created more than 1,500 jobs in the country. And the number is going up and up. And we are focusing more into manufacturing enterprises. And we are very happy to note that there are several companies into diagnostic sectors, industrial biotechnology, and waste to wealth uh, concepts. And they are all coming from Odisha and uh, they are growing to next level. What you provide is not only mentoring, but also provide them world class infrastructure, even the pre production facilities where you can really, they can really produce it with very little investments. And we provide those technical infrastructure, mentoring program, and more on that, we also bring a lot of investment funds in terms of seed fund, leaf fund, and the angel funds through our networks. And we have a very large team of almost close to 57 people in the sector of biotechnology who are promoting biotech startups in the state through our biotech incubation center. And right now we are also expanding because you have done a great job in this and you are now expanding it to east and north region of India. And the Department of Biotech Government of India, the BIDAC, has given us a mandate to work in the northeast and the eastern part of India. And now we are expanding it to those states. And uh, recently also we have opened up Manipur Technology Innovation Hub and trying to promote startups of the northeast region in their own states. So I thank SNT Department, Science Technology Department, Government of Odisha for supporting us, the MSME Government of Odisha for supporting us. And right now we are going to bring a bigger platform so that we can promote more manufacturing enterprises in the sector of biotechnology. With the primary objective of promoting biotechnology in the state of Odisha, Odisha Biotech Park has entered into a public-private partnership project with the government of Odisha to set up a biotech industrial park called Odisha Biotech Park. The project aims at nurturing individuals, companies and entrepreneurs in the field of biotechnology functioning as a platform for micro, small and medium biotech organization 
and startup to be established and promoting biotech activity in the state thus creating a knowledge based ecosystem